Yeah, yeah. This is Mr. Bonafide Rhymes. Sending this one out to anyone who's got ambition out there. Anyone with drive. Anyone with great ideas. Don't be afraid to think big. Yo. Uh. Think big. Think big now. Yeah. Follow your dreams. Uh. Don't let people hold you back. Yo. All right, morning, everyone. Uh, as Sir said, my name is Breeze, which is spelled B-R-E-I-S. It stands for Brother Reaching Each Inner Soul. I'm a hip-hop MC and also an entrepreneur as well as an author. I have a book called Brilliant Rappers Educate Intelligent Students, which was published this year. Breeze has come in today and done a performance poetry assembly for our Year 11s who are just about to face their GCSEs. I wasn't raised with a silver spoon, it was more like a wooden one. I got enough beatings from my mum, considered really troublesome. But he particularly encouraged them to think about the obstacles inside their head and find the confidence to do well. I'd study for days to get A's. I was pleased to see B's. I found music, I found enough CD's. If these teachers can't teach, I can't learn. In turn, I burn the midnight oil and let the candle burn. But now the roof, the roof, the roof is on. I think it's really good because it encourages children to think of things in different ways and I think it's really helpful for children to be able to identify with people outside school who maybe conf have confronted things similar to themselves. I was born in London. At the age of eight, I left to go to Nigeria, which is uh, the country I'm from. Stayed there for six years, came back to London and really found school challenging. And I remember when I was going to take my GCSEs, we took um, science as physics, biology, and chemistry. And my teacher said, I shouldn't even bother taking the harder paper. That I'll fail straight away. But there was a voice that I heard that said, you can do it, man. <laughs> and for whatever reason, I believed that voice. So I, you know, I studied, studied quite hard, got to the exam room, I saw the paper and I thought to myself, you see, you should have listened to the teacher because it was hard. <laughs> I did the paper, I got my results and I passed. It was the one exam that I thought I was definitely going to fail, but I passed. And what it really taught me was that there is the ability for every one of us to actually do things that at some point we think we can't do. When we practice and when we learn how to do it, we get that confidence to do it. And I've got this saying that we always have to think big. And that just means believing in your ability to do things that maybe you thought you couldn't do. Think. All right, I don't know what it is, yeah, but this side is just slaying you lot right now. All right, so we need a bit more, a bit more volume from you guys. All right, crossing border lines with broader rhymes, I generate ideas that blow your mind. You see, my awesome mind is more than rhyme. I'm thinking all the time with thoughts of mine. My thoughts are 3D and HD all combined, sharper than the spines on the porcupine. Signed, sealed, and delivery is. Full of imagery, vividly visualized through my eyes, spoken terrifically. I'm so unique, my own shadow can't even mimic me. My visions make me think into infinity. Do things differently with authenticity and aim high specifically. Cause inside of you and inside of me, there's a place that we hide that no one can see. Do you know what you want and who you want to be? We're bigger than we think, but it's hard to see. So think big. Think big. Think big now. Thank you very much. <laughs>